This is the Samurai Sword Letter Opener from Nikon. Nikon is a studio in Japan who make handmade cutting stuff. Nikon is located in Saiki City. Saiki City has been known as the City of Swords. The swords made here were held in high regard, being said to be unbending, unbreakable, and unrelenting. Sounds like something deadly for my office desk. These swords were highly sought after. They were basically the Hattori Hansel swords of Kill Bill. Hey, let's go and unbox this Kickstarter project. The letter opener comes in this little brown box. And here it is. And I feel like samurai already. Hmm, katana letter opener. Let's go ahead and slowly open this and talk about the blade. The blade is 140 millimeters while the total length is 200 millimeters. It weighs 35 grams. While the scabbard is 150 millimeters and made out of molded plastic. <laughs> Just kidding, I didn't cut myself. And this is it. It looks like a great desk decoration. Looks like it fits snugly. Just take a little pressure to pop it out. You can clearly tell the blade is handmade. You can see marks on the blade where they sharpen it. The blade is not razor sharp. It's not razor kill ready sharp, but sharp enough to safely open envelopes with the deadly precision of the samurai. Nikon creates four different models, each with their samurai's respective clan's signia. The Kickstarter funded the Onda Nobunaga design. This samurai is known as the first great unifier of Japan and was given the nickname the Demon King. He led a war to unify Japan in 1560. Next we have Dante Masumune. He was a daimyo of northeastern Japan and was a well-known powerful strategist. And due to a missing eye, he was called the One-Eyed Dragon. The third sword we have is Sanada Yukimura. He was recognized as the last Sengoku hero and the Crimson Demon of War for his blood red banners and armor. He withstood attacks by numerically superior forces. The last design we have is Tokugata Ieyasu, known as one of the three great unifiers of Japan and as the harbinger of peace. He was the founder of the Tokugawa Shogunate in 1603. So I got mine on Kickstarter for 5,000 yen or $44, then found the other designs on Amazon for much cheaper, only 27.79 cents. I was wondering what gives, so I checked the Kickstarter and it was because they were funding the limited edition Oda Nobunaga design, which is what I got. I got the black limited edition version for $10 more than the cooler looking red Oda Nobunaga Katana. I wish I got that one instead. Only if I knew it was already on Amazon. <clears throat> Anyways, I really love the desk piece. It looks great on my desk and really brings the Bushido spirit to my desk. Thanks for watching my video. If you got your own pair, leave me a comment below and let me know what you think. And for every light on my video, I will buy 100 Shiba Inu tokens. That is right. I'm gonna buy 100 Shiba Inu tokens just for myself. All right. Okay, bye. Have a nice day.